Welcome to the show, everyone. This is Retro Gaming Adventures with Master G. I'm Master G, your host. Today, we're going to play a little slalom on the NES. Ah, this is a game we just unboxed this week. Came to us in our April 2021 mystery box from VideoGamesMonthly.com, a subscription service you can sign up for depending on where you live in the world. They will let you pick your games, pick your consoles that you have already that you want more games for, and then uh, every month they send you a box, and it contains a whole bunch of retro game cartridges or discs, depending on which consoles you choose, and you get to keep those games. So it's pretty awesome. It's a service we subscribe to, and we do special unboxing videos every month. We just did our, we just released our April 2021 box, so check it out if you haven't done so already. Spoiler alert, though. One of the games we received was this game, Slalom, the game we're going to be playing today. Um, if you've never tuned into our show before, if this is your first time, do me a huge favor. Click that subscribe button. It's right there at the bottom of the screen. There's a little watermark, too, in the lower right corner of this video. Click that. Click subscribe. It's totally free on YouTube. So uh, we'd love to have more subscribers. You know, we're trying to grow the channel. So uh, hit subscribe. Hit the like button. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you like about our show, about our channel. If you're a retro gaming enthusiast, let us know if you ever played this one, if you enjoy it. I try to respond to every single comment we receive, so I love hearing from you guys. And, uh, yeah, that's that. Let's get after it, shall we? All right, good old Mount Nasty. Did you guys know that was the name of the mountain in this game, Mount Nasty? It's true. Right there it is. We can play Snowy Hill, Mount Nasty, or Steep Peak. Let's start with the easy one. Snowy Hill feels like the easy one. Qualifying run. I don't know how to I don't know how to control this. Like I don't actually know what I'm doing here. Do I speed up? I jump. Okay, so that's the jump button. Oh, both buttons jump. Oh, okay, so up will make you go faster and down will make you slow down. Okay, I got you. Wait, do I have to do I have to weave? Do I have to weave in and out of these? Is it like a real slalom? I don't understand. Am I going to get penalized if I don't... Uh... Ooh, he bumped me. What a jerk. At least you can't go off the side. That's helpful. I mean, I'm going real fast now. Oh, no. I just ate it. I just ate it. Oh, I just ate it again. Okay. This is intense. It's intense, guys. It's intense. Must go faster. We only have 16 seconds left. Oh, there's the end. And I did it. I qualified. Victory! Master G, victorious on his first ever run on the Snowy Hill course in Slalom, the NES game. A fast time reward. Solo bonus. Uh-oh, Cotton Candy. That's an interesting name for a course. Can I, like, jump over trees if trees get in the way? Woo! Alright, so you don't want to run into the flags. The flags are just in the way. Ugh. Okay, I mean, I assume I need to go through these checkpoints, right? Do I get penalized if I don't? Like in a normal slalom? I don't know. It's alright, we can hit it. We can hit a couple posts. Probably can't hit too many other guys, though. Feels like, from what I remember, Slalom was like a solo event. Like, there wasn't extra people on the course with you. Ugh, oh, come on. Ugh. Oh. oh, right into the tree. Alright, so he's not going through the little checkpoints, so maybe I don't have to either. What's the point of the little checkpoints, then? I don't understand. I mean, I'm going to try to go through them, because, like, it's habit. You're, pl you're playing a slalom, and you see a little checkpoint, you got to, like, zigzag through it. Alright? Alright, this one's harder, but I think we got it. I think we got it. I think we're at the bottom. Four seconds left. Oh, God. One second! Oh! Point one eight seconds left on the clock. Master G victorious. 
Oh my god, folks. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Skid Row. They call this one Skid Row. All right, I think what we learned is you probably don't need to go through the checkpoints. You just need to stay upright. Whoa. We're flying, man. What are these? We got like little, little sledders bouncing around. I don't know. I don't know what that's about. Whoa. Whoa. Hate it. Get up, get up, buddy, get up. Oh, he's like, Dad, oh, come on, that's unfair. Oh my god, okay. We gotta go, we gotta hustle. Man, Skid Row is hard. This is a hard course. What are these, like, little yetis? Little snow monsters. Someone has constructed. Ugh. I am not gonna do it. I don't know about this one, guys. There's just too many people. Why are there so many people when I'm trying to do my run, man? This isn't... That's not how the slalom works, you know? It's time. You go, and then I go. We don't go at the same time. That's dangerous. You get injured. Well, if I didn't hit that tree, I think I would have had it. But I think uh, I might be... Might be screwed here. <gasps> 1.94 seconds left on the clock. I did it again. I am unstoppable. I'm so good at this game. I've never played this game before, but I'm so good at it. What do you got next for me? Snowy hill, snowy slide. This one looks treacherous. This one looks real treacherous. I'm going real fast, though, I'll tell you that going real fast. I'm gonna hit these jumps, too. I wanna hit some jumps. Alright, come on. I missed all the jumps. Come on, let me hit a jump. Yeah, baby. Love those jumps. Can I do tricks? I wonder if I, like, hit the jump button off of those. If I can, like, if I can, like, launch myself. No, it didn't work. Just a normal jump. Woo! Oh, I jumped over that guy. Maybe that's what you're supposed to do. Jump over the people. Ah, oh, ate it. It's alright. Oh, I ate it again. Oh, wow. Only 15 seconds left. Come on, we're so close. Keep going fast, faster, 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 faster. Must go faster. Oh, we did it. 190 kilometers an hour. Hour. I'm a speed demon. How am I so good at this game? How am I so good at slalom for the NES? Crystal Cruise. This is a long one. It's a big mountain. Let's go fast. I'm just going to jump over people from now on. Now that I know I can jump over them. That's going to be my new plan. Oh, I didn't want to jump over that, though. I wanted to hit that ramp. Oh, come on, no way. Whatever. Am I getting penalized if I do that wrong? I don't know. Is this, like, real slalom, or what? Oh my goodness, look at these guys. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. This isn't good. There's too many people on this course with me. Bumping me and stuff. Bunch of turds. Woo! Woo! Oh, I almost had it. Not really. I was completely out of control there. Oh, come on. Unbelievable. Let's go. Come on. Get up. Get up. Get up. They're all bouncing me around here. Jump oh, come on, I can't jump over that tree? What do you mean I can't jump over the tree? I got mad ups. You gotta let me jump over these trees. Oof. Bumping me again. Yeah. We weren't even really close on that one, though. We made it pretty far. We made it to stage five, Crystal Cruise. How many are there? Overrun, the Big Dipper, and the old Blue Mongoose. 
Oh, man. Hey, I did alright, though. I did alright. I did alright. Master G did okay for his first run. Come on, for my first run? I did pretty good for my first run. I just didn't get to... didn't get past Crystal Cruise. It's respectable, guys. It's respectable. Okay? It's respectable. Alright, we started with Snowy Hill. Let's try Steep Peak. And then we'll do Steep Peak before we do Mount Nasty. Because Mount Nasty... Mount Nasty is nasty. You don't want to mess around with Mount Nasty. You gotta be ready. You gotta warm up to Mount Nasty. Steep Peak. The qualifying run. gonna jump every time someone gets near me because lame I couldn't jump because I was coming down on the on the on the on the hop on the on the ramp cut him off Don't bounce me into those trees. Get out of my way. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Like a boss. What's that in between his legs? Oh, it's just space. It looks suggestive. Just saying. Just saying that little white pixel. All right, Steep Peak, the teaser. This is just the teaser. Look at his, look at his tight buns. Don't you like his tight buns when he goes downhill like that? His tight 8-bit buns? Who out there had a crush on the slalom guy? Huh? Huh? I know some of you did. Don't lie. Whoa! Alright, I didn't get I didn't get fully wiped out like like that. Okay. This is a hard one. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. I don't need to go through these checkpoints. They're just a waste of my time. Gotta get out of the trees. There we go. Ugh. Ugh. I don't know, they're just there to distract me. All these, like, checkpoints. I don't know what the point of them is. You know, like, what am I supposed to do? It doesn't matter if I don't go through them, right? I don't, like, lose. Whatever. Whatever. These trees are not threatening. It's the guys. The guys are the... <laughs> Point one two seconds left on the clock. A tenth of a second. I wasn't even paying attention either. I was just I was just focused on the slopes. Blue Max. Oh goodness. What is this course? Bure, good to see you in the chat, my friend. How you been? It's been a whole day since we last spoke. We're playing slalom today. It's intense. I don't like these little sledders. They're always trying to trip me up, but it's a good thing I can jump over them if I have to. Oh no. Jumped and I landed right on that other skier. That was not the right play. Ah! Taken out by a sledder again. What are they doing on my slope? I'm making my run. I'm making my uh, my slalom run. I got yetis. I got kids sledding in the way. I got all these like other skiers here screwing with me. Get, out, get away from these snowmen. Ah! Barely. Oh, come on. He took me out. Why are there so many people, you know? That's not how slalom works. That's not how the slalom works, you know? It's one at a time. It's not safe for us to be zigging and zagging all over this hill at the same time. It's just not. It's not safe. I don't have a chance. It's over. God, I was close, though. I didn't do very well on this hill, on this mountain. What do you think? Are we ready for Mount Nasty? Take this little 8-bit skier with his tight buns and go down Mount Nasty. We didn't even get to see the whoosh or any of those cool uh, 
We'll have to try this one again. We didn't get very far. We didn't get to do the whoosh, the high octane, the rock and roll, the monster run, or the super downhill. We didn't get to do any of those. I mean, God, I only beat one. I only did the qualifying run in the teaser. I couldn't even beat Blue Max. Brutal. Brutal. All right, Mount Nasty, it's time. Let's do it. Qualifying run, here we go. There's a lot of trees in Mount Nasty. I don't like all the trees. That could be problematic. There's too many trees on this course. I'm gonna break a leg. Oh, I should've just taken that. Woo! Woo! One more. No more trees, please. Please, no more trees. I can deal with the, I can deal with the little bumps. The little snow bumps. I don't want to deal with trees. Ah, yeah, there's a tree. Oh, I landed on my feet. Look at me. Look at me go. Look at me go! Oh, not that time. 15 seconds left in our qualifying run. I need to get these guys out of my way messing with me. Jump over him. Five seconds left. Alright, we made it. We made it. We did it. We got this. We got this. Alright, alright. Here we go. Freestyle points. Can you do tricks in this game? I need to consult the manual on this one. See if you can do tricks. In the trees. Oh, I hate the trees. Courses with trees are the worst. I can't jump over trees. Oh, it slows you down when you miss them. Is that what it does? When you miss the little checkpoints? Yeah, it put, he pumps the brakes whenever he misses a checkpoint. So it is kind of like it penalizes you a little bit. Just a little, though. Now, man, Mount Nasty is tough. I'll tell you that. We just if we just crash into everything on the way down. Oh come on! This guy's just in the way. There's too many people on these courses at the same time. How am I supposed to dodge all these people? Are you kidding me? Oh my God, really? You gonna come at me with all this nonsense? I'm just gonna stay on this side. Jump. 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 Oof. Got launched. Got launched that time. Alright. What else you got for me? Oh, you're gonna make me do checkpoints? That guy's not going through the checkpoints. He's just trying to take me out. It's not fair. It's not very fair at all. He's not out here to slalom. He's out here to take me out. You know, what's he doing here? I'm trying to make my run. I'm just saying. Jesus, this is just silly. Mount Nasty is the worst. I don't think I'm ready for Mount Nasty, guys. I do not think I'm ready for Mount Nasty. We couldn't even beat the first course. Not even the first course in the trees. Cut loose, hot dog heaven, rad run, paradise, the exterminator. Well, that's slalom, folks. What do you think? It's a little challenging. Mount Nasty. What a name. What a name for a ski course. I like the I like the easier one. I like Snowy Hill. I was good at Snowy Hill. Mount Nasty. I guess we gotta try again. This is long. These courses are long and there's so many other people trying to take me out. It's messed up. I mean I'll jump over guys. I'll jump over guys all day. Like, how do I dodge all the trees? I'm 
going to keep going real fast. Look, this guy's just taking me out. He's taking me out. Let's do some tricks. Do some tricks. I'm just saying, let's do some tricks. You got all these... There's no trick button for me to do tricks. That's what I want. I want the trick button. Oh god, here we go. Just bouncing around on all the trees again. Tell you what, there's too many trees in Mount Nasty. They need to trim some of them. You need to cut some trees down if you're going to make me do ski on this. You know, I'm just, I'm just saying. It's, it's dangerous. I'm going real fast. Jump over you. Give me some freestyle points. None of the buttons do anything on the jumps. I don't know what they mean by freestyle points. I'm pretty good at the uh, I'm pretty good at the qualifying run. Pretty good at the qualifying run, but I can't beat in the trees. The first actual course, I cannot I cannot defeat. I can't get to the bottom of the hill in time. I don't know what the strategy is like. There's just dudes everywhere crashing into you and stuff, you know? Maybe you just jump a lot. Maybe you just jump a lot, and then you can jump over them, maybe? Maybe that's what you do. I gotta be going pretty fast if I'm gonna jump over a dude, you know? I mean, you can't just be going real slow. better this time. I'm doing, doing a little better. Well, that's that. Well, that's that. Just jump over these kids. Oh my god. Unbelievable. Get these kids out of here. They're just messing with me. That's what they're doing. Oh my god, a tree. Jumped. I can't jump over trees, apparently. Trees are too tall for me to jump over. God, it's fast. We must be in a real downhill section here. Why doesn't this guy have to go through any of the checkpoints? I don't understand. It's not fair. There's so many. Dude, screw the checkpoints. I'm over that. He pumps the brakes every time I miss one, so... I don't think there's any way I beat this. That's freaking wild, man. I don't know how you're supposed to beat that. It's just the first course. I mean, there's seven more. There's seven of them. I can do the qualifying run, but I can't even beat the first course. Whew, that is brutal. Want to get to Rad Run and the Exterminator, you know? All right, let's go back to the beginner mountain, Snowy Hill. Let's see if we can beat Snowy Hill at least. I'll see what I can do. You never get going as fast on Snowy Hill, but there's still plenty of people in the way all the time for some reason. They're not gonna let me do my run. And it's just slow. Look, it's trying to, trying to run me off the course. Look, that one's doing it too. That's all they do. They just try to get in your way. That's bull. That's BS. I'm calling shenanigans on that. I mean, this one's pretty easy, right? You can just basically go right down the middle. God, I had 30 seconds left on the clock. Points. Give me my points. How do you get freestyle points? I'm pushing all the buttons. I don't know how. Alright. I can pause. What does select do? Nothing. I can jump. I can jump a lot. Does that give me points? It doesn't. All I can do is jump. There's no trick button. You can 
crash into slalom posts a lot. I'm got pretty good at that. Pretty good at crashing into the posts. Ah, that was pretty good. That wasn't bad. I'm holding my own here. Got, got this guy crashing into me. Dick. He's a jerk. Get out of here. Jerks. Get out of my way, are you kidding me? Am I gonna jump over all the other skiers? Is that the only way to avoid them? Is to leap over them? Ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Get out of here, dude. Oh, yeah, can't jump over trees, guys. I'm not that good. I'm good. I'm just I'm not I'm not that good. There will be no jumping over trees today. See, at least they keep the trees on one side of the course. Easy difficulty, my friends. Where are my freestyle points? Mm. Alright, alright. Not bad, not bad. Skid Row. Oh, I remember this one. Go, let's hustle. Jump. Oh, come on, no way. This is with all the kids. All the kids and the snow monsters. No monsters. He ran me into him. Get out of here. Why are there so many people here? Get out of my way, you jerks. Five seconds left. Oh, and I ate it on a tree. Oh my god. They even beat the second one on the easiest course. Good lord. This game's difficulty is unbelievable. Gotta be Crystal Cruise. Go next. We'll try it again. I'm getting discouraged, I'll tell you. These games are they beat you into submission. And then you don't want to play anymore. That's what game that's what video games were like back in the back in the eighties. Come on, let me do jumps. Let me do jumps! Oh, you suck. You never let me do tricks. Anyway, I'm pushing all the buttons. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. Trust me. I don't know how to get freestyle points. Somebody's got to Google it for me. Tell me how to get freestyle points. Qualifying run. Easy peasy. Easy peasy on the qualifying run. Uh, uh. All right, what's next? Cotton candy. What do they call this one? Yeah, cotton candy. Cotton candy slope. Here we go.
focus, Master G. Focus! Don't want to lose on the cotton candy slope. That's embarrassing. now. Alright, we did it. We beat the Cotton Candy now. Can we beat Skid Row? I did it once. Like, my first attempt, I did it once. But, uh, can't beat it a second time, apparently. It's so long! Why is it so long? And there's, like, little kids everywhere. Like, playing on the mountain. I'm gonna kill someone. I'm gonna kill a child in this game. It's not safe. I'm just saying, it's not safe. Look at this. It's not safe at all. Okay, get these kids out of here. Avoiding the snowman. Avoid the snow monsters, the yetis. And the people. It's really the other people you want to avoid, because they're the ones trying to take you out. Oh, I can jump them? I can jump over the yetis? Oh, I should just jump over them then. Screw that. That's what I'm going to do this time. Oh, that's no good. I thought that was going to take me out, but we only have 14 seconds left, so I think we're at the bottom. I think we're like right there. I think we just gotta. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Skid Row. All right. What's next? What's next? Feeling good now. Feeling loose. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. What do you got for me? Snowy slide. Here we go. Oh, man, it's one of these like real spinny ones. Look how, look how high I went. That was awesome. Get some jumps. Where my jumps at? Get some jumps. Oh, come on. Don't make me bounce off them. I want to jump. I want to go high. Oh my god, I'm going so fast. This is the fastest one yet. I slowed down. I slowed down a little too much there. I didn't mean to slow down that much. Oh, I can't believe I landed on my feet. Good job, me. Ho ho ho! Snowy slide. Victory. Man, that was a fast one. That's a short one. It's like wicked fast. Okay, what's next? Oh, the next one is the Crystal Crystal Cruise. This is the one that got me last time. It's the one that got me last time. that dude. Wait, I'm supposed to be in the middle? Oh. That wasn't clear. Uh-oh. Yeah, that was bad. Uh-oh. Yetis! Hard. There's just too many of these things, and they're all, they're all just like so random, you know. Like I can't discern any pattern. But they're just everywhere. At least I can still jump over people. Oh, 
Not trees, though. Cannot jump over trees, Master G. Oh my god, there's only 17 seconds left? God, we don't stand a chance at this one. Do we? Not a chance. Oh, we're already at the bottom. Oh my god, we were like... We were like 20 seconds away! This one's stupid hard. I don't know how I feel about all that. I think we're probably going to cut this stream short. It doesn't look like we got a lot of interest in Slalom on the NES. But, if this was one of your favorite games, I would love to hear from you in the chat. Give me some pointers, because we'll pick it up again. You know we're going to be playing this game at some point on the NES Happy Hour with Fitz and Master G. And while we're on the subject of the NES Happy Hour with Fitz and Master G, Season 7 begins with a Season 7 premiere on Monday, May 24th. That's very soon. That's only like 11 days away. So mark your calendars. Hit that subscribe button. You do not want to miss out on the NES Happy Hour with Fitz and Master G. When you do subscribe, you'll see a little bell. All right? You're going to want to click that bell. You're going to want to turn on your notifications because you want to tune in live. There's no commercials for our live viewers. If you watch after the fact, you're going to have to endure the commercials because I got to make some money. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make a living here, you know? So uh, turn your notifications on. You'll get reminded when we go live and you can tune in and be part of the action. The NES Happy Hour has completely original Nintendo cocktail recipes that I make and drink on the show. It also has, in addition to great NES gameplay, manuals, box art, and a very special bar trivia challenge at the end of every episode where you, our live viewers, you get to play along at home. I play game show host. You're my contestants. I'll ask you bar trivia questions. You can shout them out in the chat. It is a lot of fun. So you're going to want to tune in live for that. Um... If you feel compelled, join the G-Club. Support us financially. Keep me in business. Put food on my table. Put a roof over my head. Uh, 99 cents a month. That's all it costs to join the G-Club. Just 99 cents a month. Right now, you'll get a sweet loyalty badge, depending on how long you've been a G-Club member. You'll also unlock a bunch of ex exclusive G-Club emojis. And uh, more members we get, the more perks and bonuses and extra things I'm going to be adding to that 99 cent membership. So I would strongly encourage you to join the G-Club today. If you'd like to donate to our stream, you can pop on over to our website, www www.fitsandmasterg.com. There's a little donation portal there. It's through Streamlabs. So, um, you know, if you want to put some money in the game fund, please feel free. You know, when you uh, give us donations on Streamlabs, I actually get to keep most of the money. When you uh, do donations through Super Chats or Super Stickers here on the YouTube, uh, guess what? YouTube takes half of it. So I only get half of the money when you do that here on YouTube. But I get almost all of the money when you donate on our website, www.fitsandmasterg.com. You'll also get to leave a little message. It'll appear on the stream, so you can say what you want. The, the little alert box will pop up and read out whatever message you wrote for me. So uh, consider doing that and uh, consider tuning in again because we're going to be back. We'll be back tomorrow with another great retro game. I don't know. I haven't picked, w picked which one we're going to play tomorrow, but we do try to play through all these games we receive in our mystery boxes from videogamesmonthly.com and we have plenty more that we need to get to. So I'll pick a game and we'll be back live again tomorrow. Same time, same place here on Retro Gaming Adventures with Master G. We'll see you then.